So, I'm Skyping with my friend from Vancouver, Alexandra Wickler, and she says to me, Ann, like, how come every time we Skype, you're totally ass naked? I'm like, oh shit, like, she can't handle the truth, so I tell her, oh, Wickler, it's because I got this wood-burning stove in here and it, it keeps it too hot for clothes. And she's like, oh my god, like, Ian, that totally makes sense. And honestly, that's really sustainable of you. Good on you. And it got me to thinking, what do people in Vancouver like more than being politically correct? They like being sustainable, and they like telling other people how to be sustainable. So I thought, in the spirit of Vancouver, I'll make a video showing you how to sustainably heat your homes without the use of those goddamned fossil fuels. So let's get our cutie patooties out in the forest and find us some wood, alright? I hate fossil fuels. I got too extreme. Wood. Now, this next part of the process can be really hard for us Vancouverites because you have to go out and you have to kill lumber. But I've pioneered a new artisan Vancouver Commercial Drive approved approach of felling trees. First of all, you have to do yoga because you need to like be in touch with the energies of the forest and stuff. Second of all, you have to embody the spirit of the interior lumberjack while at the same time embracing the practices of the metropolis tree hugger. That's right. We're just gonna hug trees until they fall over. I don't know why anybody's never thought of this before. It's definitely the most ethical, sustainable, and Vancouver-made approach to felling trees. So here we go, watch how it's done. I find a tree that like I really vibe with, and I sort of I come up to it, and I just sort of converse with it a bit, and I tell it how I feel. I think we really connect. I love you. I want to strip that bark off you, you dirty bitch. It's safe. You're safe with me. Kind of hug it. It's okay, baby. It's okay. not gay if it's a tree. The most sustainable and ethical method of getting your wood home is actually quite simple. You just want to gonna get the trees and start throwing them. But be sure to obey all local traffic laws. Don't throw through red lights and try not to throw faster than 25 kilometers an hour in school zones. So until next week when I show you how to chop up this wood and get it ready to burn. Go out there and just start throwing trees around.